Welcome to this StatsCast. In this StatsCast, we're going to be reading the abstract of a journal article and then extracting information about the research question being addressed by the article. Now, we can understand a research question by looking for the four potential components of that research question. They are the population, the outcome, the comparison, if, if any, and the intervention, if any. And we can remember these things through the POKI acronym. Now, in this journal, abstracts are required to have a very uh, defined structure that makes it fairly easy to find most of this information. Most journal articles, or at least not all journal articles, structure their abstracts in the same way. For example, the population is listed here. Adults with type 2 diabetes. Presumably, though it's not explicitly stated, these adults are randomly selected from a particular community also. And the authors may have presumed that these adults were somehow representative of a wider population. Now the outcome is mentioned here, but no details are given and the response variable certainly isn't given. But later on in the abstract we learn a little bit more about what these, the outcome is and what these um, response variables might be. They must measure this thing, whatever, you, whatever that is, glycated haemoglobin, and also the subject's weight. So that would be the response variables. The comparison being made here is between two types of education programs that the, the participants receive. They receive a diabetes patient, patient education program, and another group receives the same thing but augmented by a community self-management program. So those things prefer those things to find what we call the comparison. This means that the explanatory variable is the type of education being received. This education is also the intervention as the education program is assigned or imposed upon the subjects. And so we have a population, we have an outcome, we have a comparison, and we have an intervention, which means that we could define the research question in those, in those terms. We don't have time to do that right here. But because we have all four of those terms, we have what we call an interventional research question. And because we have an interventional research question, the type of study is called an experiment. And in fact, the abstract makes it quite clear that this is a randomised controlled trial, which is a particular type of experiment. We know this is an experiment because the treatments, in this case the education programs, are assigned to the groups. And because the, the groups are randomly allocated, people are randomly allocated to each of these groups, this is a true experiment. If it was a quasi-experiment, we would be allocating, we would be imposing these treatments to groups that already existed. One other, other thing to note in passing is that our outcomes are measured at two time periods, which means that um, there's a within uh, subjects uh, aspect to this study as well because each subject is measured at two times.